friends welcome back to another video welcome to our first snow day of the winter i'm so excited if you know me you know i love weather of all kinds i'm fascinated by it i will take snow every day every single day in the winter i probably should live in like canada or something but it's my favorite and it's finally snowing we've had three years of no very 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 little snow i've lived here i've lived up here for um almost 30 years and the last three years we've had the least snow ever like since I've lived here so it's so exciting that it's finally snowing it's not gonna be a lot they were saying we are probably gonna get about two inches um I'll be I'll be happy with two inches I'll be so happy with two inches the weather channel changed it and said three to five for us but I'm not really buying that I tend to believe our local guys way better than the weather channel but um, we'll see I mean I would take an inch and be happy so it's beautiful it's so beautiful when it's falling and it's timed so perfect today because it's gonna be falling from like about noon until like sunset so or about five or six so the, the hours when we can actually see it falling I was thinking it was gonna be snowing overnight but it's actually all during the day so that's because my favorite part is actually watching it fall it's so beautiful so I got some potato soup going in the crock pot I have had this on my meal plan for several weeks and have not made it and what better day to make it than a snow day <laughs> Marion and Jackson won't eat that at all they won't touch it so I'm gonna be doing some other cooking today some meal meal prepping for Jackson and then um, I, I'm probably gonna make like some pancakes and bacon for us right now because that's what we always make on a snow day <laughs> and I have to make bacon for my potato soup anyway to put on the top so I'm gonna go ahead and dirty up my kitchen but that's okay we're gonna have some yummy food and I do already have some dishes in the sink, so we'll just do all of that as soon as I'm done cooking. I've also got to keep going on the laundry. Today's Monday, it's Martin Luther King Jr. Day, so we have no school. Um, and so I already planned on finishing up, I thought I'd show you the snow falling. I already planned on finishing up my like laundry and stuff because Jackson would go back to school tomorrow, so I'm just telling you what's in my mind. <laughs> He's probably gonna go snow day tomorrow though. That's what we're hoping for. It is starting to stick which is way fun. You wanna go outside? You sure? Yeah, you're always ready for a party, aren't you? Always. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. There we go. Let's see, I have Krusty's buttermilk and then I also have cinnamon churro waffle. I don't think I'm gonna do waffles. Yeah, we'll just have good old buttermilk pancakes. My kitchen is absolutely trashed. I feel like there's bacon grease from floor to ceiling. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this cleaned up. I did make a bunch of chicken, so I need to finish meal prepping for Jackson, but the soup smells so delicious. So delicious, so I gotta take care of all this. I went ahead and made Marion a plate. He had already eaten lunch, but I'm gonna save this for him for his dinner because he won't eat potato soup, so he can just have this for dinner. a bright star in the dark space mm, babe it never worked out with the others all we ever did was fight and at one point i would never thought that i would meet someone like you this time it's all different you got every little string on me the way you make me feel is crazy how did you get so fly you got me like Cause you are shining way more than 
three o'clock and the big flakes are back so that's exciting had me worried there for a little while it all changed to sleet the big flakes are back usually that means that they don't stick around too long is what I've been told that flakes stick together more when they're when it's a little bit warmer so but I'll take it it's beautiful I love it when it's falling it's my fave I got Jackson's stuff in the freezer, so now I'm gonna go ahead and finish all of this. Just need to wash these caraway pans by hand, a few, a few other things by hand, and then I'm going to put some laundry in. I have one more load of laundry. So it is four o'clock and it's still coming down really good. I have this, I have been wanting to do this for so long. I mean, I've lived in this house 20 years this year and I did it one year, but I didn't do it right. So <laughs> this year or last year I started, I go and I stand in the same spot in front of my house and I take a picture like when the season is like, obviously for winter, I would like to take a snowy picture of my house and then in the fall when the trees were just just at the most beautiful colors I took a picture and then I'll do a spring and I'll do a summer and then put them together in like a photo collage I did this years ago but like I didn't stand in the exact same spot so the pictures were a little off but this time I know like exactly where to stand so I did it in the fall and I'm going to go outside and take a picture today because this will be the perfect day for us a winter picture of the house yeah. my Chloe there's Chloe. You hear those crazy dogs? Anyway, I thought I'd put on my coat, go out before it gets too dark. It's four o'clock, so it's gonna be, the sun's gonna be setting within the next hour. So I'm gonna brave it and put my coat on. I think actually it's only like 20, 
it's 20 something degrees like 28 degrees it's actually not that cold compared to some of you guys and i don't have little kids who want to go out and snow make snowmen and sled or anything so jackson rather stay inside where it's warm it's also not deep so i can just put on these <laughs> i don't need to put on boots or anything It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. Maybe I underestimated how deep it is. <laughs> my socks are getting wet. I wanted to come out here and move this off of my sweet Claire Bear's grave. She's buried right here. That little, that little hump. I don't have kids that want to go out, but I have animals that want to go out. I came inside and they were like, Mom, you left us in. We want to go see the snow. Okay. Don't slip, my loves. Whew. Let's see. I would say it's about an inch. You love it, crazy girl. Do you love it, Belle Belle? She's always a little more wild than Ollie. <laughs> yeah. I see you. Come here, Belle. <laughs> you just got a burst of energy. And Belle Belle went inside. <laughs> Ooh. Potato soup is smelling delicious. It's the onion that really makes it smell so good. So I guess it's been on low for four hours. So I'll probably do it in at least another two hours and then I'll add the cheese and the heavy cream and then let it cook for like another hour. I ate a big lunch so I'm not going to be hungry for a while but this is going to make a lot and I will be able to have leftovers which is so nice. You're watching the kids outside? The Buffalo Pittsburgh game is on. It is. I don't know the temperature there, but it looks so cold. <laughs> Look how cute. <laughs> Clyde likes to sit on top of the vents. He's pretty smart. Claire used to do that too. Chloe's got the electric blanket. So it's getting dark fast. Here's a look at it before. Before the sun sets and it's harder to see, but it's definitely getting thicker. They said once the sun sets, it's going to accumulate a lot faster, and I can see it already is. We just got the text, no school tomorrow. We got a snow day, so tomorrow my plan is to decorate for Valentine's Day. I definitely have wanted to do that for almost a week, so that, that video, I promise, I promise, is coming up next. It's 5.30, so time to probably check on the soup. I'm gonna see how soft these potatoes are. I need to, I'm just gonna use, I like to use just a potato masher when I, when I make this. 
they're not quite ready. I think I might turn this up to high for an hour or so just to speed it along, although I'm not hungry. So I think a snow day calls for some baking. <laughs> I was gonna sit down and do some editing, but I just don't want to right now. I'm gonna do some baking. These are Jackson's favorite strawberry. So I think I'm gonna do both just cause I don't have like a small muffin pan. So they'll get eaten. I'll do both of those. And then I got this at Ollie's for a dollar. I see you, my Chloe. I see you, are you hungry? <laughs> okay. She really wanted me to sit on the couch and cuddle with her. She kept trying to get on my lap. I know, baby. But I was like, I kept getting up. I'll go cuddle with you soon. Anyway, I got these for $1.49. These are never that cheap. So it's peanut butter chocolate chip. I'm going to make these for me. I don't really love peanut butter cookies. They're not my favorite, but they're chocolate chips. So they can't be too bad. All right, they need to go back out first. Are you confused? Looks pretty, pretty thick up there. Come on, Ollie. So my potato soup is pretty much done. I went ahead and used my potato masher and just mashed mashed it up, but I left it real chunky. I definitely like it with more chunks of potato in it. So I'm gonna just add about a cup of milk, I mean a cup of heavy cream and a cup of cheese. And then we'll let that, you know, come back to the temperature before I eat it. But it's basically finished. I'm just gonna let the cheese melt. All right, I got the kitchen clean for a second time. I didn't want to go to bed with a dirty kitchen as much as I cleaned it earlier. So I went ahead and unloaded and reloaded the dishwasher. That noise is Marion, like, he's got a nail gun. <laughs> he's, he's building something, always building something. But um, I think I did, I just watched our local weather guy and he said we got like two to two and a half inches i think that the heaviest has stopped now so we'll go out and do one more check before i say good night but if you've watched any of my snow day vlogs before you know that 
One of my favorite things to do on a snow day is to watch the movie Frequency. It's with um, Jim Caviezel. It, I never watch it unless it's a snow day, so it's a must. So I'm going to put that in and probably do some editing while I have it on. Just sit down and relax. Cozy up with my fur babies under a blanket, but we'll go out and do one more check of the weather and see what our measurement is at our house. <laughs> Well, oh, my light keeps going off and on. Right at three inches at our house. It's beautiful. I'll take a three inch snowfall any day. Any day, it is absolutely beautiful. I love how bright it looks out here after it snows, even though it's dark. This is the movie with Dennis Quaid and Jim Caviezel, and there's my Chloe. Yeah, you wanna watch it with me? Anyway, it's such a good movie, and I only watch it on snow days, so it just reminds me of snow days. <laughs> Madison and I always watch it together. I'm going to sit down and watch it and probably do some editing, try to get a little bit of work done. Tomorrow I will be filming my Valentine's Decorate, so make sure that you come back and watch that if you're interested in that kind of video. Um, I'm excited to finally get it up. Tomorrow is the 16th of January, so I've only got another month before Valentine's will be over. So anyway, I hope that you enjoyed hanging out with me on this simple snow day at home it was so wonderful and even though i didn't do a lot of sitting it was just nice to be at home and watch the beautiful snowfall i'll never get tired of it i'll never take advantage <laughs> take it for granted when it is snowing uh growing up in texas we didn't get many snowstorms my whole life so i love them i'll always love them so stay safe out there stay warm a lot of you are telling me you're in the deep freeze the crazy crazy cold air i know it's most of the country is under like all kinds of winter weather advisories and watches and warnings so i know it's crazy out there so stay safe stay warm thank you for watching i love you guys and i'll see you in my next one bye bye